Hello and welcome to Mustang to Millionaire. I'm your host, Charlie. I'm going to document the experience of using a Mustang to farm a million out the UEC. Let's go. I made my way into space. I'm going to accept mission. Hold the arm. It's important to note to be able to do bounties in Hurston or Crusader, you have to do an authorization bounty contract. Um, they're very similar to the CS level 1 bounties. I'm only going to make you watch one full kill in the Mustang Alpha with the stock weapons because it does take quite a while to kill enemies. What I was trying to say before the police scuffed my audio is, now that we have about 10,000 out of the UEC, we need to head to CRUL5 to buy some weapons. Proximity alert. Deck. Landing complete. I'm going to buy two size 1 gimbal mounts and two CF117 Bulldog laser repeaters. Good purchase. I'm going to go ahead and equip these weapons and then head back to Hurston. I really enjoy grinding missions in Hurston as there is good variety between ECNs, bounties, and searching for the missing crew members which all pay very well. Your journey begins now. All systems operational. Ah shit, I forgot to get quantum fuel. Don't be like me. Remember to refuel your vehicle. The other option with the Mustang is to just blow it up and claim it as it only takes five minutes to get a new one. However, I only recommend doing this if you're extremely broke, because it does take time.
getting your first extra set of weapons makes a huge difference. So I got interdicted on the way back to Hurston and tried to get my audio on so you can catch my reaction. We are getting interdicted. the first bounty with the additional weapons, it adds about 400 DPS. of me killing bounties and getting money for the next upgrade. perfect example of the Mustang Alpha's paper shields at work. The M50 has, I think, size 1 missiles and it almost completely destroyed them. So you can see during this fight, I flew backwards into an asteroid, nearly completely destroying my ship. I lost movement left to right and started spinning uncontrollably. This wouldn't have been so bad had I had enough money to buy the next set of upgrades I wanted, but I was a few thousand short. I woke up at CRUL5, not enough money to upgrade, had to go back to Hurston.
In this instance, I wish I had landed at Everest Harbor. That way, I didn't have such a long flight back. While traveling to the first new bounty in Hurston, I was interdicted by a colorless black. Decided to run away and head towards the next bounty. to take a CS level 3 mission if there were no other CS level 1 or 2s available. I would recommend sticking to the level 1s and 2s, especially before you upgrade your shields and your size 2 weapons. I was going to originally try to kill the Cutlass first, but then I decided to take out the Buccaneer to reduce the total damage that I would take. strategy for taking out the colors is to watch my shield circle around him and make sure I don't get hit.
we go, the cutlass is destroyed. Now that we've completed that mission, we have 28,000 out UEC, which is enough money to get our next upgrade. However, I'm going to continue to do bounty missions until my ship no longer flies. Fly. After completing this mission and checking the mission tab, seeing that there were no level 1 or 2 missions available, I decided to look into the investigation tab. I saw a mission to find the missing crew and accepted it. They're a great value. So here all you're going to do is fly around and look for the bodies of the missing crew. Where are you? Where are you hiding? Fuck that hurt. These shitty weapons will be replaced soon. After the shame of not being able to find the cargo officer, I had to prove my worth, so I accepted a CS level 3 mission. Let's see what happens.
After successfully completing the CS level 3 mission and my confidence to the roof, I decided to accept another. Let's see what happens. survive I'm fucked destroyed weapon systems destroyed engine systems destroyed well at least they get new weapons now Now that I've revived at CRU L5, I'm going to head to the weapon store and then head to the component store. So I'm going to buy two CF-227 Badger Laser Repeaters, and then I'm going to head to the component store. At the component store, I'm going to buy a size 1 charger power plant. The reason I went with this power plant is it will allow me to upgrade my shields in the future. So after fully upgrading our weapons, we have 16,000 Alpha UEC. And we are well on our way to our next upgrade, which will be a shield and a cooler. While I'm applying these upgrades to my ship, I want to thank everybody for watching. And this will be the end of episode 1 of Mustangs to Millionaire. Please feel free to give feedback in the comments down below.